around the wall, uh, and these sumps will collect the groundwater and pump it back outside the wall. It's impossible to reach the house safely as the water's too deep and the current's too fast, but we were able to talk <coughs> on a video call. Finished it in the middle of September and we tested it in the middle of October. And it's worked? Definitely worked, yeah. This is the second test. This flood's actually quite a high one. It's close to the record in 2020. It's a lot easier now with the wall, uh, but also for the long-term benefits of the structure of the house itself. Um, a flood isn't going to do a house any good, so holding the water away from the walls is, is going to be better in the long term for the house. I think the biggest danger is a little bit of cabin fever. As long as we've got enough shopping and red wine or whatever, <laughs> we, um, we're all right. We're okay. The Luptons have stopped up and are sitting it out until the water drops, hopefully by the end of the weekend. Phil Mackey, BBC News, Worcestershire.